So today, this is a quick review for the application Car Index, which is available in the uh, App Store from or since the 7th of September 2009. There are two applications, Car Index and Car Index Lite. The Lite version is a free version, a more trial version to check out yes, two contents. Car Index is a full version that supports all the contents. So let's go into the app. It's a splash screen and there you see the application. It works actually pretty simple. You select a canton, in this case it's Fribourg, but as you can see from the list here there's a whole lot of cantons. So you click select Fribourg, you type in license plate number, so let's say we type in this one, 12345, click on search and we wait for uh, a couple of seconds and there you see the person we found and in this case we are can also give the guy uh, a call we can save the app into a list of safe plates which you can see here we can put them uh, add them to our contact list the native contact list within the iPhone application uh, oh, and as you see here on the back you see that his license plate number is stored there in the note and we can locate the exact location of this person so it uses an embedded version of Google Maps and there is this person living as I said there are all kinds of applications all kinds of contents that we can select for instance we can go to Zurich and do the same there and with Zurich there's something special which is uh, happening in a couple of contents that is you have to fill in a security code before you get access to the um, license plate data that's not something that we put in that's something that the canton Zurich put in and unfortunately we're not able to um, or allowed to uh, remove this capture so we fill in this code and uh, then we wait and also in the with the canton Zurich and also a couple of others they've built in an artificial waiting um, period of 30 seconds so this takes some time it, it has nothing to do with the application but it has to do with the fact that uh, the canton Zurich is building in this uh, has built in this uh, this artificial uh, uh, waiting line waiting period of uh, at least uh, 30 seconds so again here the name of the person who owns this license plate number okay well some other remarks there are contents like for instance the canton Geneva which is not available directly in the application this has to do with the rules in uh, the Canton of Geneva so here you can send a uh, paid SMS if you click on the button send an SMS it automatically happens within the application um, there are also contents like for instance Obwalden where if I type in there a license plate number we get a message that the Canton of Obwalden only allows license plate inquiries by email if you click on send email then it opens your native email client on your iPhone and will then send out an email directly to the canton um, I think well I think that's it very quick overview in less than four minutes give you an overview on what's happening and what is possible with this application